Benedictine begins a tough stretch of games this week. Their next four games include contests against Charlton County, Tattnall County, and an improved team from Brantley County. But before those games, the cadets host a tough squad from McIntosh County Academy. McIntosh has responded nicely since its season opening loss to Liberty County. The Buccaneers have won three straight and scored 114 points in that time. McIntosh won last year's meeting against the Cadets 42-21 after scoring 35 unanswered points after falling behind 21-7 in the first half. Now the Bucks ripped off several long runs for scores and took advantage of some miscues by BC special teams. Benedictine has not forgotten how it lost to McIntosh last year and knows it can't afford the same mistakes of a year ago. And through five games this season, there's little reason to think the Cadets will repeat those mistakes. BC has been efficient on offense, moving the ball downfield and limiting turnovers, while the cadet defenders, meanwhile, have been outstanding and, after giving up several big plays to the Buccaneers last year, definitely had something to prove. I went out to BC this week to talk to Coach Mark Stroud and ask him if his cadets will draw any extra incentive given how they let last year's game slip away. Last year's last year. We're we're here in a new year, new season, and we're kind of doing it a new way. So we look at each week. We prepare for our, you know, we prepare what they're going to go against us, and we just feel we got a lot of confidence rolling into Friday night. Now, a big piece to McIntosh's win last year was the 238 yards by running back Darius Robinson, which included touchdown runs of 60 and 85 yards. Now, Robinson isn't with the Buccaneers this season and his loss I think is huge to this game. A the only potential Achilles heel I see possibly to the BC defense is speed. Robinson had a ton of it and if he were playing I would wonder if the cadets would be able to keep up with that speed. With him out and given the way BC's defense has played thus far this season I'm hard pressed to go against the cadets and I'm picking them to knock off the Buccaneers 24-14.